In this video, you'll learn how to find out the suppliers of any seller on Amazon or any competitor you find online in the United States for free. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and be sure to hit the bell button to be notified when new videos come out. Now, every shipment that passes through a seaport in the United States is documented on the public record. And with a free tool like Import Yeti, you can access these records to find useful information about any company's suppliers. And with this data, you can research your competitor suppliers. If you're looking for a new factory, you can easily find and use the exact same manufacturers as your competition. You can discover your competitor's best-selling products. If you need product ideas, you can find out what your competition is importing from China. You can know how much your competition is importing. Analyze the health of your competition by dissecting their entire supply chain. And you can also negotiate better pricing. Find out how much you are buying compared to other sellers to negotiate better pricing with your factory. Now in this video, you'll learn how to use a free tool called Import Yeti to access the US import and trade database to find wholesale suppliers. Now first off, what is Import Yeti? Well, Import Yeti is a free online tool that allows you to browse the US import database to find out where retailers are sourcing their goods. Every shipment that passes through a port in the United States must have a bill of lading, which is free and public information. Now, a bill lading contains important information, such as the date of the shipment, the name of the factory, the factory address, the retailer name, the shipment weight, shipment quantity, country of origin, and other detailed shipping parameters. Now, Import Yeti was created by David Applegate in order to make import data accessible to e-commerce sellers. And the tool is 100% free, and David accepts voluntary donations to maintain the software. Now, how does Import Yeti work? Now, Import Yeti works by collating over 70 million US Customs C shipment records into a searchable database online. Now, all you gotta do is just type in the name of the retailer you wish to research, and Import Yeti returns the following information. Total C shipments over time, a list of suppliers, product breakdowns based on HS code, a list of the top 10 wholesale vendors, top 10 supplier relationships, and a breakdown of imports per country, and a list of the most recent C shipments. Now, you can use this information to reach out to the exact same factories as your competition and have your goods made by pre-vetted suppliers. Now, is Import Yeti legit? Well, Import Yeti is 100% legit and safe to use. The software simply collates information that is publicly available online into a searchable database. Now, in the US, customs data and import records are public information. As a result, any company that imports products into the US from a foreign country by sea is documented on the public record. All import records can be accessed directly from the United States Customs and Border Protection Agency, and other countries actually provide similar documentation, but Import Yeti only supports the United States at the present time. Now here's how to use Import Yeti to find suppliers. Finding suppliers with Import Yeti involves four basic steps. One, you need to find the legal name of the company you're trying to research. Then you use Import Yeti to find out your company's suppliers. Then you research potential suppliers by browsing the US import records, and then you determine whether the supplier is a good fit for your company. So let's break this down step by step. Step one, find the legal name of the company. Now, before you use Import Yeti to conduct a search, you have to find the legal entity name of your competitor's business. So first off, locate the brand that you're trying to research. And in this example, we're gonna find the legal entity for a private label company on Amazon selling garlic presses. Now the brand name here is Mitba, but by typing this name into Import Yeti, it yields no results. Now this means that the brand Mitba is not the name of the importer on record. So before performing a search on Import Yeti, you must first find the real company name. Now every serious brand on Amazon files for Amazon brand registry, which requires a trademark. As a result, you can find the real company name by performing a trademark search. Now using a tool like Justia, performing search on the brand name. Now here, Justia reveals that the brand Mitba is registered under Galati Adi. Now step two is to perform a search on Import Yeti. So now that you know the legal entity behind the brand, you can type that into Import Yeti to retrieve the results. And in this example, you would type Galati Adi into the tool. And look, there's a match. Now by clicking on the result, Import Yeti will return all the import records for that company. Step three, use the import records to research potential suppliers. Import Yeti will provide you with a list of suppliers that the company uses along with detailed shipping records for each vendor. Now, according to Import Yeti, the brand Mitba imports their garlic presses from a company called Shanghai Shindig International. Now from here, Import Yeti allows you to perform further research on that supplier by clicking a link. 
Using Import Yeti, you can quickly perform due diligence on any of your competition suppliers to answer the following questions. Does the supplier ship to your country? If the supplier has never shipped to your home country, then you should probably not use that vendor. How large and established is the supplier? Check to see how many customers the supplier works with, and if a supplier makes only a couple shipments per year, then they're likely a small factory or middleman. What production volume can the supplier handle? Based on the size of the shipment sent, you can determine whether a factory has the capacity to meet your production requirements. And does the supplier work with reputable brands? If a supplier works with well-known brands, they are likely reliable with exceptional quality control. Now the final step is to determine supplier fit for your company. Now just because you find a reputable supplier on Import Yeti does not mean that the vendor will be a good fit for your company. You also have to find out whether the factory can match your production requirements. So for example, popular brands like OXO, Sur La Table, and Williams Sonoma import garlic presses from a company called Wonder Household. As a result, this factory likely produces high quality products with excellent quality control. However, these companies also import hundreds of thousands of units per month and likely have extremely high minimum order quantities. Now, if you're a brand new seller, you can't use the same factories as the larger players. Instead, you wanna find a supplier that is willing to work with a company your size. And overall, there are different factory types that work with different size companies. Browse the shipping volumes for each manufacturer to find one that meets your requirements. Now for more information, you can watch this video on how to approach a new wholesale supplier. Now you're probably thinking to yourself, man, I don't want my import records to be shown in the public record. So how do you hide your bill of lading and your import records? Well, you can hide your bill of lading from the public record by using a third party exporter of record service. Basically, a third party handles the entire shipping process on behalf of your company and becomes the supplier of record for the shipment. So as a result, your real supplier info will not be displayed on the bill of lading. The other way to hide your import information from the public record is to request confidential treatment of your shipments. There are three ways to request confidentiality. One, you can submit an automated online application for electronic vessel manifest confidentiality. I'll post a link in the show notes. You can also send a paper request to the address, which I'll include in the show notes, or you can submit an email request to Vessel Manifest Confidentiality at cbp.dhs.gov. Now, all confidentiality requests must be renewed every two years, and you must submit renewal requests within 60 days of expiration. Now, what are the alternatives to import Yeti? And this browsing of the public record is not new info, really. But there are three import Yeti alternatives, Pangeva, Import Genius, and Jungle Scout. However, all three tools charge a monthly recurring fee compared to Import Yeti, which is 100% free. But here's an overview of the three Import Yeti competitors. The Jungle Scout Supplier Database. It's a tool that allows you to browse the US import database to find your competitor suppliers. But compared to Import Yeti, Jungle Scout offers a better user interface and collates to import records in a more organized fashion. However, Jungle Scout does cost money. But if you sell on Amazon already, chances are you already own Jungle Scout. And the good news is that the Jungle Scout supplier database is included for free with any subscription. The second tool is called Pangeva, and Pangeva is a service that provides a searchable database to research the entire supply chain for any company. Now, Import Yeti offers the exact same information as Pangeva, except Pangeva charges a high monthly fee to access the same data. Right now, Pangeva does not publish the cost of their tool online, and you must request a free demo to get pricing, but in the past, Pangeva used to charge $299 a month. And the final Import Yeti alternative is called Import Genius. And Import Genius is a service that provides real-time shipment records for any company in the US using a searchable database. But they also offer complete trade data for the following additional countries as well. With Import Genius, you can find data from Argentina, Bolivia, Chile, Colombia, Costa Rica, Ecuador, Mexico, and a whole bunch of other countries as well. Now overall, Import Yeti is equivalent to Import Genius for accessing US import data but the main reason to use Import Genius is to access the additional country info. Now you should leverage these import records to find and vet suppliers. And thanks to Import Yeti, you can have access to the import records of any company in the United States. Now this information is especially useful for Amazon sellers. When a competitor undercuts you in price, you can find out who their suppliers are and ask for similar pricing. When you wanna vet a new supplier to make sure that they're legit, when you want to find suppliers that are not listed on Alibaba, and when you want to find out how your shipping volume is compared to other customers to negotiate a better price. Now, in the past, all this data used to be expensive, but thanks to Import Yeti, this data is now free for the masses. Hope you enjoyed this video. 
Now, if you like what you saw, there's actually a lot more where that came from if you subscribe to my channel below. And if you are interested in learning how to sell physical products online, then click over here and take my free six day mini course where I'll walk you through everything that you need to know to get started in e-commerce. Thanks for watching.